ever find yourself running on empty, with your mind and body screaming for a break, you're not alone. Let's dive deep into a concept you've likely heard of, but might not fully grasp. Self-care. When you hear the term self-care, you might picture bubble baths, spa days, or indulging in your favourite desserts. While these can be forms of self-care, it's so much broader than that. At its core, self-care is any action or behaviour that benefits your emotional, physical, and mental well-being. It's about understanding what you need to do to recharge and refuel. This includes activities that improve your physical health, like eating balanced meals, getting enough sleep, and engaging in regular exercise. It's about listening to your body's signals and responding to them. This is about recognising and honouring your feelings. It can mean journaling, talking to a trusted friend, or seeking therapy. It's about giving yourself permission to feel, without judgement. Humans are social creatures. This pillar involves connecting with others, whether it's spending time with loved ones, joining a club or group, or simply engaging in social activities that bring joy. Stimulating your mind is as crucial as taking care of your body. This can be through reading, puzzles, or even taking a new class. It's about continuing to challenge and engage your brain. This doesn't necessarily mean religion, though it can. It's about connecting with your inner self, maybe through meditation, nature walks, or personal reflection. Self-care is not selfish. It's necessary. Think of the analogy of the aeroplane oxygen masks. You need to secure your own mask first to help others effectively. Also, self-care doesn't always mean treating yourself. Sometimes the best act of self-care is setting boundaries, saying no, or even seeking professional help. With the hustle and bustle of life, stress is inevitable. Over time, if not managed, this stress can lead to burnout, anxiety, depression, or physical ailments. Self-care acts as a buffer, helping us cope better with life's challenges. Remember, you can't pour from an empty cup. Begin by assessing your needs. What feels draining in your life right now? What activities make you feel refreshed? Start small. Dedicate just 10 minutes a day for yourself initially and gradually increase. Remember, it's a journey, not a destination. Self-care is not a one-size-fits-all concept. It's deeply personal and evolves as we do. In a world that often demands so much from us, remember to pause and take care of yourself. Because you're not just worthy of care, You're deserving of it. Let's make self-care more than just a buzzword, but a way of life. Share with us in the comments how you plan to embrace self-care this week. And remember, every step, no matter how small, is progress. Like, share and subscribe to my channel for more enlightening videos on mental health. Support our content by hitting the bell icon to stay updated on future posts. And don't hesitate to drop a comment below.